and I'm the uh, sales and marketing manager of uh, Accra City Hotel and uh, I must say welcome to Accra City Hotel, welcome to Accra, welcome to Ghana. In the last few years uh, Accra City used to be uh, no hotel and we rebranded uh, and it's been almost four years now and we are the oldest four-star rated uh, hotel in the city of Accra and uh, recently we were awarded uh, the uh, ISO certificate and we are the first ISO certified uh, hotel in West Africa and that is a huge shock uh, on our hotel and we were privileged uh, to, to have world travel awards and this is the biggest award in the hospitality the hotel sector in the world and it's, it's known as the Oscars of the uh, hospitality sector in 2019 Accra City Hotel won the leading hotel in Ghana so basically Accra City Hotel was 30 years last year. We were established in 1988 and uh, we're almost 13, 10 and 31 years. And we're still running strong and we're still outperforming a lot of uh, our competitors. There are a lot of unique hotels in Accra. I mean, Accra is the best place to be as we speak right now. And every hotel in Accra has its own unique features. What makes Accra City Hotel unique is we are in the heart of the business district of Accra. Uh, so be it uh, business, uh, leisure, this is the place to be. And we stand on our location and the service we provide to our guests is uh, one of the best in the city. And it's for that reason we still exist and we're still performing uh, at the highest level. <laughs> um, our, our rooms are very comfortable. I mean, we have three grades of uh, uh, rooms. We have be the standard room, the superior room, and the uh, executive suites. And all our rooms, what is most important is come with complimentary minibar. And as a matter of fact, we are the first in the city of Accra to be providing a complimentary minibar. Uh, be the cold drinks, the fridge, the hot drinks on the table. We provide these for free. I mean, we go to other places, it may be part of the cost elements of the uh, service you get in the hotel. But for Accra City Hotel, our uh, mini bar is free and complimentary. We do not charge a penny. That's the end day, guests come here to conduct their business for leisure, whatsoever. Yeah, that cost, but your mini bar should not be uh, part of the cost uh, you carry home. So for Accra City Hotel, mini bar is certainly complimentary. Yeah. We have 196 rooms. Uh, in the hotel and uh, we have plans to add more rooms because uh, anticipating the future business in Accra should be growing uh, so we are adding on more rooms uh, to the facility and the existing conference room we take around uh, 250-300 but because of high demand in the city for big conferencing for special events we are, as you can see to my uh, right hand side, we're building a huge conference center which will take up to a thousand capacity because the demand is in Accra for such uh, huge event halls. And uh, if all goes well by end of next year, it should be ready and it should be operational. Our swimming pool too is undergoing a major, major, major refurb. Uh, we have new towels coming in which we've shipped, it's coming over by uh, next month, it should be in. We are redecorating that whole uh, patio area the swimming pool, the decking area, because at the end of the day, what is important is service to your guests. 
you want to make your guests happy. You want to stand out. You want to be unique in what you're selling. And that is a huge, huge important side to our security. For us, what is key and what is important is our guest because they are coming away from their home and you want them to feel comfortable and make them feel like here is your second home and that is basic so whatever we'll do to make them feel comfortable whilst in accra we will do to uh, make them feel comfortable starting next month accra city is facing out all plastic straws and we bring in paper straws because we are big on the environment and everything we can do to support the environment Accra City will do. The same way we also use paper bags and not plastic bags. In terms of uh, our rubbish segregation, that is key and it's important to us. So we do segregation of our bins. So it is not uh, uh, it is environmentally safe in everything we do. And when you go into our conference rooms, the bins are also segregated so the client also is very much aware of what we're doing here when they are putting uh, rubbish in the bins and that is important to us. Recently uh, refurbished our uh, gym and it's now looking spanking new, fresh and clean with new equipments in there and that is not the end. As part of the expansion project we're doing, we're actually building a bigger gym to accommodate the needs of the environment, the society we are in. Um, the new uh, expansion project would also make an allowance for a spa uh, of course it's, 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 a, it's a big need for the society now people come and request a spa and we also with very few hotels in the city of Accra that has a tennis court because uh, for some reason people who lodge in Accra city hotel are big on fitness and in the morning if you come here you see uh, our guests on the tennis court playing hitting the balls enjoying themselves having fun and we also provide free coaching for our in-house guests who lodge here. We show them how to play tennis, those who want to learn how to play tennis. And with the food, we have varieties, right from local dishes to continental dishes, and we vary them. We don't do the same thing every day, but at any given time, we have that variety, be it continental, local dishes, uh, spicy, non-spicy, vegetarian, uh, extreme vegan, norm in our menu, of course. We go above and beyond all the time. We will do just to uh, make you happy. Accra City will be there next 40 years because, I mean, we've done 30 years, which has not been easy, but we have achieved. Uh, by then, hopefully, all this renovations going on would be done. Uh, you'd have new faces uh, coming in. At the same time, too, we hope to retain the existing clientele who have been coming here from the past. But it's not just about attracting, attracting new people to come in. It's about keeping those loyal guests who have been coming here since day one. But of course, I can't fully predict what the future would be. But what I can assure is, whatever the needs of our guests are, we would always improve to meet the needs of our guests. That is the bottom line. We are here to serve the needs of our guests. So whatever our needs of our guests are, we are there to support, improve, and to uh, provide what their needs are.